you've just got your connected car. And as it's completely free to use for an incredible seven years, you must be pretty eager to set it up and get going. Well, strap yourself in, as we're going to take a quick trip through the setup process for the car and the Uvo app. Let's start with the connected car. Everything is set up on the touchscreen. You simply scroll across to the menu. Then you tap Uvo. You'll see three options appear. You select Uvo settings and then tap Activate Uvo. Next, you select Terms and Conditions, read them and tap Agree. Do the same for the Privacy Policy, read and select Continue. At the bottom of the screen, you'd select Next. The Uvo services will then activate. Tap OK once it's complete. Finally, you'll be prompted to share information to use TomTom and Kia Live services. Simply tap Activate and you've now got direct access to live functionality like traffic, weather, parking and POIs via your connected car. The Uvo app unlocks even more functionality, so let's set it up. Before we begin, you'll need to download it on your Apple or Android device, and importantly, you'll need to be with the car. As this is the first time using the app, click Create Account. Then confirm your location. Once you've selected your country, you can also select your chosen language, using the menu icon at the bottom of the screen. Read and accept the terms of use and privacy policy then click OK. You'll then need to input all the requested information. Once complete, tap Sign Up. Your account has now been created. Click OK. Enter your mobile number and click Verify. You'll then receive an SMS with the verification code. Enter it in the box, then click Confirm and Proceed. Click OK on the success screen and then set up a four-digit PIN for security. Press Confirm and Proceed and that's it. The Uvo app is all set up. Now we just need to add a car. The important thing to note about adding a connected car to the Uvo app is that, again, you need to be with the vehicle to complete the process. In the Uvo app, you need to select Add My Car. You then need to read and agree to the terms and conditions and privacy policy. This is why you need to be with the car. You need to enter the VIN number. There's a handy button at the bottom of the screen if you need help finding it. Once entered, select Send Verification Code to Vehicle. On the screen in the connected car, you'll see a pop-up. Click Yes to see the code. Type this code into your Uvo app, then click Add Vehicle. You will then see an Enrollment Successful message on the touchscreen. Tap OK. Back on your Uvo app, you're presented with a quick help guide. Scroll through each screen, then press Skip. That's it, your connected car is now added and the app home screen will load. When the time comes to sell your car, you'll need to fully deactivate Uvo. From the home screen, scroll across and hit Uvo, then tap Uvo settings. Scroll down to the bottom of the list and click deactivate Uvo and reset to default. Uvo services are now disabled. They can be activated again by pressing activate Uvo and following setup again. You're now more connected to your car than ever before. Watch our Using the Connected Car and the Uvo app Fast Facts video to see what you can do. And keep your eyes peeled for more Fast Facts as further amazing Uvo features are developed and released.